Hi everybody, good evening. I'm doing this old authentication. This is a really uh, confusing one because it's too much. Uh, to be honest, <laughs> I was talking to Grook AI and uh, ChatGPT and DeepSeek and Claude the AI. It's the only one that was able to give really. Uh, they all figure out uh, how the the challenge work, but. Uh, of course, this uh, they will give you uh, to download the files here. Uh, uh, when you download them, there is a binary on them, so you get the binary. Now, if you open it with uh, Ghidra, if you have Ghidra on your computer, uh, when you open it in Ghidra, of course, the, or the first thing you always do, I don't know, is the can you make it bigger? Uh, tool option. I don't know where is the so this preference is no preference help okay any case uh, let's make it zoom it so basically whenever you, you start Ghidra is always go to the main function you go to the main function you start here you say before we go jump there let's do something quickly no uh, no I was testing here uh, where is it uh, where is Firefox uh, I open it in machine this is try to understand it uh, also here, try to understand what's going on. Uh, uh, the IP of the machine is uh, yes, that's there. If we go now to uh, to the machine, you do and see, of course, because it's binary the way this CTF work. You can enter the key if you said. For example, test. He said no, no, and you're done. So now you don't know what uh, do you want to do now with this binary. Of course, when you have binary, you go to our friend Ghidra. Ghidra, when you open uh, the binary in Ghidra, you can see the function. There's a couple of functions. There's check, change, compare. This is the, this is the fail. Of course, it succeed. The succeed tell you, for example, uh, error flag dot AC does not exist contact administration if something is wrong otherwise we'll give you the flag print the flag so we need this to go to the success function the main one you can see it's a print enter the key and then it start doing very funny things here in the enter the key first of all um, where is that uh, where is that 16? It need to be 16. I, uh, you see this this one it get lost me in the translation. Uh, th no, this is where is that 16 things? Uh, hexadecimal 10. I don't know where is that 16. It disappeared on me now. Yeah, this is the 16. Need to be 16 length, and then uh, the character number. This is this is two. So it's a zero one two. Need to be Q, and the last one need to be something four, and then they do another check here. It, it, it divide by four, and then divide them some kind of eight and five, and divide by three. And then uh, there's a lot of uh, variable running on circle. This, this one to, to do it with yourself, I, I, I don't like you guys. I just ask uh, the only one who can really figure it out nicely is Claudia AI. The other one, they explain the strategy, they can tell you, okay, and then it passed to the to get to go to uh, the check. There's the change. The change is where the XOR coming in, uh, some XOR happening there. And then the check, that's why they check the whole things. Check, uh, uh, start doing uh, the way to do it. And let's go back how the I got the help, as I said, from the, the AIs to, to explain these things. For, oh no, before we do this, uh, there's a key and there's a username because then there's another check happening. The username is easy. Uh, username get check in uh, compare with. Target. I think the function is compare of target. If I'm mistaken, yeah. Uh, it compared to this uh, string, and this string we can see it here. It's here. E L B B four uh, R. You can see L B W. But the way do you can see it's adding two to whatever you type. So if you type later on a username, it add two. 
to it is like switching character position so because this one we know what we're it looking for so we so we need just to type we need to type with a minus so basically uh, a target is there and it's switched by two so uh, this one uh, representation of the letter e l b four r t zero p w n this is the the parameter which we have it here now to pass there what i'm doing now where is the firefox and then uh, we do minus two to get to get the uh, because it is doing that uh, shifting by two here so basically now so us if we want to type a username we need to to type this one this is the username 10 characters because the, the application will add two to it so we, we minus two to find this it add two to reverse it to find it's equal this the username part is not that hard to get it so it's cag underscore 2pr dot null so we know the username is there when it arrives to to the key the key is that uh, is a bit headache headache uh, was uh, no this one uh, no i'm not supposed to show that i need to cover it now I I was testing and I suppose not to show that part of the video. Mm. Any case, let's uh, that one. Let's close it. <laughs> Any case, so the uh, the key which function is the, the key uh, 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 the change function. Uh, if we go now to uh, to the to to the to, to the change function. the change function is where the key is start uh, running in circle here I, I, I can't lie to you guys I'm not 100% understanding it I got help from uh, Claudie and ChargeBT and DeepSea uh, all of them uh, it, it, this is task is not uh, it's not some pen or paper you can do it um, so it's performing an XOR operation on each character of your input with a value uh, 52 uh, where is that value i don't know where is that value again which computer uh, in decimal this means when you input a string that's the key each character gets exhaled with 0x52 before the checks are applied so the key must be equivalent to 16 this 16 we note from the main function that does does uh, i think it's here uh, the, the, the change local and then it XOR, uh, XOR, uh, XOR the third character must be Q we know the check that uh, number 4 and Q that here uh, let's move this there step 5 it uh, uh, constructing the key we need a 16 byte key that after change satisfy the length 16 by 2 third use means be for Q and 4 we know the key and 4 this one and then the check the um, some uh, what they call is the um, I forgot the name modulo zero uh, three eight five three the three uh, eight and five and three this what he's doing here uh, and that's now and the question is the key might be binary when I was doing with the uh, chargebt and even with the uh, group or something they release uh, they show you a key that this key is possible but it seems not working and then what I did I just asked uh, Claude he said let's go uh, uh, a different way just let's want to create a Python script that use this logic and get the key and send it straight to the machine so we don't need to worry about binary stuff so now we know this one uh, this, the, the python script that do this is findkey.py is a bit complex the way I do key I'm not sure if there is a simpler way to do it you can see all this XOR uh, happening uh, using the, the key and then at the end you find the flag so uh, basically that's what you do to run this we just need to run uh, python 3.9 i always use that one find i need to put the ip of the machine and the port of uh, so we have that and then you run it and you get the flag of course this version because i'm doing a video i need to hide that one i forgot i didn't close it uh, this is the flag you get a response automatic you get a reply so basically you do everything 
uh, using the hex uh, version of it so this is the username we talk about the username then he got the flag so uh, guys I can't explain to you too much about what's the logic too much logic happening here so sorry about that uh, I'm not sh uh, to understand it but uh, the whole story is in the check and uh, and uh, check and comp no uh, check and the change function and check and compare to target. Uh, th this uh, th no tombak card is the username. We know the username. This one it's easy part. The one is the check and change. The one that do all these binaries. So okay, this one is hide the f in the comment. I will put uh, the full version. The, the same script you can run it from computer. So it run. Uh, it is run fine from the attack box and it, it uh, uh, run from uh, 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 your computer so uh, in my computer no I don't need this one I was working in a binary that's why using uh, virtual uh, python I couldn't solve the binary in any case it's not my, <laughs> my cup of tea so I'm doing this in case someone can help I can understand the code uh, but I'm not 100% understand because uh, as I said when they try to uh, to understand it is just um, too much headaches um, because now you need to have the, all these conditions set the letter uh, the current second byte is Q the 15 byte is 4 and uh, you need to write algorithm so if you do it yourself without an I am not sure if there is a quicker way uh, okay guys so I will put um, the full script the one that showed the flag this one just because I'm doing the video I'll put a link to it and yeah I hope you like it guys and sorry for if I'm not very clear and hope uh, this video will help someone thank you very much and have a good day